The last few days have been really challenging. Um, we've been trying to wait, make our way around a place called Dungeness. Uh, we pulled out short at Hive uh, because the conditions were, were just too strong for us to fight against. I was very fortunate to meet a gentleman down there who reached out to us on social media called Mark Rose, um, who is the sailing captain at the Vaughan Water Sports Club um, just outside New Romney. Uh, Mark was uh, a very experienced uh, windsurfer and paddleboarder and uh, a real gentleman because him and his wife very kindly looked after us for two days, which was amazing. Um, but what was was great is he had so much knowledge of that particular coastline uh, and he actually guided me through he paddled alongside me and took me around uh, Dungeness Point uh, which was which, which was greatly appreciated after Dungeness Point though what we went into was straight into a, a live military range which I had to negotiate getting through that was um, was a real challenge because we had a certain time window. We had between four in the morning at first light and eight in the morning, and I literally scraped through with about six minutes to spare, um, which was which was interesting. Um, and then it was it was a real good session. I think I did about 35, 36 k uh, down to our next point, which was uh, towards Hastings. So the real challenge coming up now is Beachy Head, which is another headlands, it's another rocky cliff face. And what's particularly challenging about this aspect is it goes on for seven to eight miles. So there's no real exit points. So you need to really assess the risks when it comes to wind and tide and make sure that we're gonna get round there because there's no turning back when it, when it gets to that point. 